So, you know, why try to do the whole genome? Why not just target a bunch of genes that we know evolve slowly, but do evolve, and PCR those out? Because that's easier to do than is trying to assemble a whole genome. Mm. And then by having just those, let's call it preliminary sets of evidence, you could then say, hmm, this actually reproducibly, if I take a sample from the finger, I take a sample from the bone marrow, I take a sample from here or there on the body, and I take a sample from different, the three different main things, and I see the same mutations, and they're different or somehow aligned with hominid evolution, right? We compare it to all the known hominids. I mean, that would be the kind of data that you could actually publish in a journal like Nature if you did it right. 